He will be the champion for the fourth time. Nobody has done that before. He's run quicker than anyone else before, including himself here in London. Kipchoge is the champion again. Queen Elizabeth Bekele, the Ethiopian Olympian, the new world boy in England, in the fight. Elliot Kipchoge storms into the history books in Vienna. The first man to run a marathon in under two hours. He has done it. This year, this race will be one of the fastest races in the world. Anybody who has good uh, luck in that day makes good history, you know. I have run the fastest times in London all through from day one, right? And I trust that uh, I will run the best time, and it will be really critical for me to win London for the fifth time. My name is Ailut Kipchoge. I am a Kenyan. I am a sportsman by profession. My major thing is marathon. I'm honing. I'm our world record holder in marathon. That's around two hours and one minute and nine seconds. I'm training in Africa. I'm training in a country called Kenya. Our training camp is in Western Kenya. But it's a meet. It's the meet of the, of Kenya in Rift Valley. So it's a good place with an altitude of 24.50 and big forest near our camp you can run all over even for more than three hours without fishing the forest it's a good environment, good terrain I live in Ethiopia, uh, capital city uh, Addis Ababa of course I train around uh, you know Addis uh, has a different training uh, area so I'm going out you know I'm happy with my training and uh, of course, you know, uh, the one good thing is, you know, I'm, I'm healthy 100%. I'm, I'm good prepared, prepared. Marathon is compared to life. Marathon is the longest event as far as sport is concerned. That's a 42.195 kilometers. That's it's the longest yes, uh, event whereby human being has run the fastest time. And marathon you can compare to life. I can say it. Uh, marathon is in the hearts and in the kidneys of all the human beings. Uh, really, marathon is. Uh more uh, interested race uh, it's a long way to finish you know from to start to finish the distance by itself it's uh, challenging you have to pass uh, many challenge you know to to success you know over marathon I try all the minutes to keep my motivation up again by training in a good way, uh, talking to people, understanding that uh, in this world, worse will come worse one day. So I, I really understand what the world is. <laughs> but all in all is that, uh, you know, it's, uh, it was a hard time because London Marathon was cancelled and it was postponed. Olympics was actually postponed to next year. So it was really a hard time as far as uh, training is concerned. What has changed is that uh, we are running in a park. Uh, we are running in a loop for uh, maybe 2.1 kilometers, which can actually be translated to, to about 19 laps. So it's a different game all together. It's just running like track. It's real different, it's not like running the whole course of London, but this one is going round and, and really it needs a, a very hard minds and, and hearts to, to really catch up and maintain the pace and, and go through all those laps.
road is for everyone is similar. Uh, maybe there is uh, some more uh, curved and uh, loved, but uh, of course that is uh, equal for everyone. But uh, maybe someone, uh, of course, uh, they guess like you, uh, maybe lap it and you know it's favoring someone. But I don't think like that. I know it's uh, how difficult it is for everyone. It's not uh, really nice without big crowd. When I started running, actually my dream was to actually put a plane and fly to Europe to see how Europe is and, and, and feel that uh, 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 the sweetness of the flight when you are half the skies. I was really training well and, and you know, when I met, when, when I, I always receive uh, a lot of high advices from Patrick and and when, when, when I really actually competed uh, here in Kenya and become uh, uh, outstanding, then I saw that uh, my dream will come true. And I always uh, been guided by God that you have a good career, you have a good future, and I think the dream of, of actually flying Kenyan colors will be actually realized soon. From track to marathon, you know, I never uh, prepare mentally and uh, really physical, physically, you know, uh, I never prepared well for the records. I, I made some mistakes, you know, sometimes uh, uh, I never, uh, I could do better than this. So that makes me driving, that, that makes me, uh, all those races are uh, amazing, you know. Uh, the time I was uh, raced in my highest place, so of course uh, I remember, you know, those those races are best in my in, in my life. I think I'm a friend to Kenanisa, and I'm a, because he's my fellow sportsman. On the other hand, I've been competing with him for ten years in track and field, which was really competitive and. I think I picked him to, uh, once when in 2003, but all the years, or the other nine years, then we were second to him. Uh, we are uh, friends, you know, since uh, track racing, over 15 years, you know. Since uh, uh, 2003 Paris Championship, uh, Kipchoge was there. Both of our, you know, uh, long time rivers and uh, friends so in competition wise you know this makes also special you know Elliot Kipchoge stood standing tall standing strong and cruising now to another victory this is competition and uh, today is not uh, the same as yesterday and yesterday is not uh, the same as the next day so what will happen actually is, uh, is it's different things and you know thoughts are kind of thinking changes 28 2019 was a different year this is 2020. i went to make history by being the first man to run london five times and win london five times and i have a cool history there i have run the fastest times in london all through from day one right and i trust that uh, I will run the best time and it will be really critical for me to win London for the fifth time. Of course, in uh, marathon wise, uh, at, at this stage, uh, only two athletes running uh, uh, under two or two. Uh, to win London marathon is, uh, is uh, really special. You know, in my career, it makes big difference. You know, from start to finish, you know, I want, I want to control. You know, I want to become on top, you know, from start to finish, you know. Doesn't matter any what happening in between. Winning for me to, in this place is a big gift for me. I'll be remembered by being the first human being to actually stand up in the whole world and tell the whole world that uh, no human is limited. And I keep an example of myself by 
uh, beating the two hour mark. We come from different countries, and that's the only difference. All of the similarities we are, we are human beings. In your career, you, you climb, you know, you climb many uh, levels. When I'm starting the race, I really think that what will happen in the five kilometers is 10, 15. But I try to concentrate, go with the pacemakers and maintain the right pace. There is many challenging from home village to wallet. When you are a start line, people maybe don't realize the challenge you passed. The human beings need uh, miracle things, you know, special things can happen, you know.